Hi, I'm with Madison Calvin, who's behind the new Twitter account Positive Kick, which is also known as Keep It Kind. The account aims to spread positive vibes. How are you doing today? I'm good. How are you? I'm doing well. Good. So why did you start this? Um, so this is actually part of one of our professionally related courses. Um, so it's a promotion of communication and new media course. Um, so our final project had to be a campaign, and it could be about anything. Um, but we decided that since it's time for exams and everyone's really stressed about the end of the semester, we wanted to have like some positivity in the air and to make sure like we are going to get through the semester, everyone's going to be okay. So we just wanted to make sure that everyone saw some happiness and some light at the end of the tunnel. Um, so we decided that this was a good time to actually push it out. Mm -hmm. Now there are problems, um, sorry, there are que Twitter accounts like Ryerson Problems mm -hmm. and Ryerson Solutions. Were you inspired by any of those accounts in any way? Um, we weren't really inspired, but we did, after we thought of the idea about having positive messages, um, we did think, oh, well, Ryerson's got a bunch of different accounts like this. Um, it'd be a great way to interact with them as well, um, to get our message out and to maybe like share with them so they can retweet us, we can retweet them kind of thing, um, just to work in together. Now, how long ago did you start this account? We actually only started on Saturday, so three days ago. Mm -hmm. And what types of things have you been tweeting out? Um, so we've just been tweeting out some like positive messages, like you can do it, like the sun's gonna shine, like just different things like that, like kind of silly things, but like really happy things that like just need to be said, and like a bunch of retweets of just positive Twitter accounts. Um, so we've just been tweeting like love messages and like positive thoughts, different things like that. Given the time of the year, is it also? why you decided to start at this time? Yeah, so we decided to start, we, we thought about it because it's the end of the semester, so everyone's really stressed out, so it's a good time to throw in all the positivity that we can. Mm -hmm. Now, is Twitter the only outlet you're going to spread positivity? No, we actually have a Facebook account, we have a Tumblr, and we have an Instagram as well. Um, the Instagram, we're just kind of posting pictures of the little sticky notes we've been posting around the school um, that just have different messages and like our hashtag on it, um, so people can take photos of those and hashtag them and then we can see them. Um, and then our Facebook, we've been posting just different messages and about our event that we have on Thursday, um, which is just about um, sharing messages in between each other. Um, so like going to someone and being like, hey, hope you have a great day, or like telling them something that you never really would have in the first place, being like, you really, you mean a lot to me, like I know you can do it, like strive for your goals, like different things like that. So that's what our event was on Thursday. Um, so that's what we've been using Facebook for. And I think Facebook has been a really big push in that sense because a lot of people can see it, um, like friends post and then you can share it. Um, so yeah. So now this is part of a course. Mm -hmm. Are you going to continue with it after? Uh, hopefully. I, we never really thought about it just because we were like, let's just see what happens. But now that it's doing really well, um, and it kind of seems to just be making things people a little happier, like someone did um, post on their Instagram a picture of one of the sticky notes we posted around the school and saying this is a great thing to see right now and I was like okay well maybe we will try to continue it just because it is nice to see people being happy and knowing that there is going to be some positive attitude. And what has the reception been like? Um, so far it's been pretty good. Um, I know a bunch of my friends are really excited about it especially the, the event that we have on Thursday. People are like yeah this sounds like a great idea. So. It's been really good. Um, a lot of people are really happy to see that there are still happy people around and not everyone's just like a bitter ball. Mm -hmm. Now, are you the only person who's heading this campaign? No, we have um, five people in our group that everyone's kind of taking their own different outlet. Um, so I've got Facebook and Twitter along with another person. Someone's got Twi a Tumblr and one person's doing Instagram. So like we've all kind of been doing a different outlet. Um, but I have been going around like today, I went around and posted more of the sticky notes uh, just around the school with different messages. Okay, last question. Yeah. Um, what are some ways people around campus can spread positivity? Just by going to people and just saying, hey, like you're doing a great job, keep up with it, or I know you can get that job, or just different small things like that. It just makes a huge difference in someone's day. Even if you don't have to necessarily post it on Twitter, you have to post it somewhere. If you just say it face to face, it just makes so a smile even, just makes someone's day so much better. All right, well, thanks for joining me. Thank you for having me. So that was Madison Calvin with Positive Kick.